Well, today, Andrew, I end my series on Jackson Elementary Schools that made big leaps in this year's State Department of Education rating system. This last school worked a miracle by going from an F school to an A. Reigns Elementary is this week's cool school. What really happened was we got double the points once those kids that were at passing moved to proficient. We got a point for them being proficient and we also got a point for them moving. Principal Owens explained to me something she says many people don't realize when looking at school ratings and student test scores. That is, passing just isn't enough. The student also needs to improve from year to year. And when she got to Reigns Elementary, her job was to do both. Reigns was a turnaround school, so that means most of the teachers were new here as well as myself and the administrative staff. And they definitely turned it around. In 2016, Reigns received a literacy support award for their work with the third graders, but the rest of the school needed that same attention. We had to do that push for those kids that were passing because we were getting them up to a certain point, and then they were being stagnant. And so that stagnation hurt us. Last school year proved their resiliency. The district-wide water crisis that closed schools for days put them in overdrive once those students returned. And every staff member had a, a hand in that. Even the counselor had a tutoring group. Principal Owen says the extended school days, which made up for the time lost, really helped. And after school programs could be the key to overall success. Years ago, um, we had programs like 21st Century After School and programs um, where we had a class size reduction teacher, where teachers could focus on small group instruction. They had a small group of kids. And so that's why things like fully funded education is so important because that allows the monetary resources that we can hire the additional staff and we can run those programs. And to see the other Jackson schools highlighted in this series, visit our website, WJTV.com. And remember, you can always nominate a school for our Cool Schools segment. Just send an email telling us why your school is special to coolschools at WJTV.com. Andrew. All right, great.